Now, how do we respond sa charge nila ng punishment ay hindi nag-fit sa crime? Dito, sabi ni Dr. Craig, I flawed ang objection in two ways. Una, ang objection ay nag-equivocate between every sin na we commit and all the sins that we commit. We could agree that every sin na we commit deserves only a finite punishment, but it does not follow na if we put all our sins together collectively ay nag-deserve lamang ito ng finite punishment. If ang person daw ay nag-commit ng infinite na number of sins, then ang sum total ng lahat ng sins na yan ay nag-deserve ng infinite punishment. Now, of course, walang taong nag-commit ng infinite na sins sa earthly life. But what about in the afterlife? Dito ang inhabitants ng hell would continue to hate God and reject Him. They will continue to sin and accrue to themselves more guilt and punishment. Dito ay makita natin na ang hell ay self-perpetuating. Sa ganitong cases, ang bawat sin ay may finite na punishment. Pero dahil ang sin ay nag-go on forever, then so does the punishment. Second, why is it na every sin only has a finite punishment? Ang sabi ni Dr. Craig is that we could agree ng sins like theft, lying, adultery, and so forth ay only of finite consequence and deserve only a finite punishment. Pero in a sense, ang mga sins na ito ay hindi nag-separate sa atin from God dahil pinagbayarin ito ni Jesus sa cross. Ang sins ay already paid. One only needs to accept Christ as Savior para maging completely free and cleansed from those sins. Pero ang refusal to accept Christ and His sacrifice seems to be a sin of a different order. Kasi ang sin ito repudiates God's provision for sin and so decisively ay sineparate nito ang tao from God and His salvation. To reject Christ is to reject God Himself. And in light of who God is, then itong sin na ito ay sin of infinite gravity and proportion and therefore ay plausibly nag-deserve ito ng infinite na punishment. Dahil dito, we should not think of hell primarily as punishment for an array of sins na of infinite consequence, but just penalty siya for a sin of infinite consequence, which is ang rejection of God himself.